It all started with a simple question. Would we buy the top selling cordless drills on Amazon? We decided to challenge ourselves and see if we could find better options and stay within $10 of Amazon's price. Before we get started, understand that Amazon's top 100 lists are constantly changing, as are their prices. So these are based on the top seven cordless drills that we saw at the time that we were pulling all of our information together. So the DeWalt DCD 771 is one of the top selling drills and it's usually in the number one position. You can see why. It's got the DeWalt name and it's also a $99 price tag that includes these two batteries. Now the batteries that come with this are 1.3 amp hour. So kind of small compact batteries, really helpful on the weight, but you don't get as much runtime as you would with bigger batteries. So this is a 1500 RPM maximum drill. Now it's got two gears. So the smaller gear in this, which has the most torque, that's actually 450 RPM. Now DeWalt uses a measurement called unit watts out. You see it's got 300 unit watts out here. That's different than torque. Torque is measured in inch pounds. Some of the bigger drills that they've got, their flagship drills are gonna be 800, 900, or even close to a thousand unit watts out. So this is a little bit lower on DeWalt's food chain as far as that goes. Good drill to get started with. Uh, you do have a better option. So check out Home Depot. And for the same $99, we have this rigid kit and it includes a two amp hour battery. And when we take a look at the specifications here, this drill tops out at 1800 RPM. Now it is a two speed drill as well. It's low speed is 550 RPM. So it's faster in both the low and high gears. It also has 525 inch pounds of torque. So it's gonna be a higher power drill than you would get with that DeWalt package. And again, it includes the one battery, charger, the bag, and then of course the drill. If being on DeWalt's 20 volt battery system is your number one priority, then yes, the DCD 771 is the best deal you're gonna find and stay around hundred bucks. However, if you're willing to consider other options, Rigid offers a significant upgrade. Coming in at number two, we see Black & Decker for the first time with their 20 volt max LDX 120C kit. And this comes with one battery, a charger and then a bit to help you get started. You can see here it's a $52 kit and that battery that comes with it is a 1.5 amp hour. So one, one battery, 1.5 amp hour. As we start looking for some extra information here, first thing we notice is that we've got 750 RPM. This is a single speed drill, but we did notice that there's a little bit of a discrepancy here. So the Amazon page tells us it's got 750 RPM. But if we take a look at Black & Decker's website here, uh, we can see that they've got it listed at 650 RPM. So a little discrepancy. We're pretty sure that this was 650. It might be 750, but it is a good DIY drill. It's their most recent DIY drill. And because of that $52 price tag, it is a very, very popular option for people. However, if you would like a different alternative, Let's take a look at what Hart has going on over at Walmart. This is a half inch drill driver instead of a 3 8 so that means the chuck has a bigger capacity. It's designed to be able to do a little bit more work. And right now they've actually got a pretty killer sale going on on this right now. It's $20 off. So the kit is $39. It's normally $59. And that comes with a 1.5 amp hour battery and the charger, just like the Black & Decker one did. It has a low gear at 440 RPM and it's high gear is 1600. So you're gonna get faster speed on the top end. Price wise, they are comparable at their regular prices. And clearly right now with this one being on sale, it's, it's a significantly better deal. This one's a toss up. Both brands are solid DIY picks and their 20 volt battery systems have a wide range of other products that you can use on that same battery pack. Now, if you wanna prioritize size and weight, Black & Decker's the way to go. If you wanna jump up in performance, go with Hart. Number three is Black & Decker again. This time it's their 12 volt max BDCDD12C. There's gonna be a quiz on the model numbers at the end of this, so make sure you're taking notes. Uh, and you can see right away why this is such a popular drill because it's normally a $39 package and it's on sale for $29. 30 bucks for a cordless drill is really, really tough to beat. Now this one tops out at 550 RPM. Uh, it's gonna include the drill. It has a 1.5 amp hour battery and of course the charger. And when we looked around to see if we could find a better drill within $10, we couldn't. It, it doesn't really exist. So uh, we, we kind of cheated a little bit. We wanted to stay on the 12 volt platform and see, well, what else is at least in the same neighborhood? And another great option here is Skills Power Core 12. This is a brushless drill and the kit is $69. It's a two speed drill. You get 450 RPM on the low side. You got 1700 on the high side. It's got 350 inch pounds of torque. And this is gonna do a, a much wider range of projects than that Black & Decker drill will. But you can see, even though the kit comes with a two amp hour battery and a charger, 
the $69 price tag on this is, is significantly higher. It's more than twice the price that we see on Amazon right now for that Black & Decker. So if you are the type of person that are thinking about having higher performance, it, it's a really nice upgrade. This one's interesting because at the price, it's gonna be really hard to beat this Black & Decker 12 volt drill. And if you just need something for projects to stick in your kitchen drawer, it's a great option. However, if you've got some extra room in your budget, going to that brushless skill 12 volt drill is gonna give you a big increase in performance, features, and build. All right, number four is from a company called Avid Power. It's a brand that's only sold on Amazon as far as we can tell. And this is their 20 volt max. It's a drill that comes with a, a 1.5 amp hour battery. And it also has a 22 piece drill bit set that you can see here in the photo. And the price on this is normally $49.99. You can see Amazon's got it on sale right now for $37.39. So it's a pretty compelling option. We start looking around. It is a single speed drill that tops out at 550 RPM. And it does have 280 inch pounds of torque. So it's good for those light duty projects and repairs that you might have going on around your house. However, we actually brought this one in for testing and we broke it and we broke it really, really fast. So we don't actually recommend that you buy this drill. Instead, we think the better option is to move over to Ryobi. You can see this one regular price is gonna be about $10 more than Avid. And this kit is another 3 8 inch drill. It tops out a little bit higher at 600 RPM, even though the torque is a little bit lower. It's 135 inch pounds of torque. It comes with a 1.5 amp hour battery and a charger. Uh, as far as Ryobi goes, this is a fairly compact drill. It's gonna be easy to use around the house. And so a little bit of a trade-off, but you do have, um, you've got the advantage of being able to, to get this from Home Depot and you got the support of Home Depot and we know that Ryobi has got a three year warranty on their products. So that's really helpful too. After our experience, we don't recommend buying Avid's drill no matter what the price tag is. To us, it makes a lot more sense to go ahead and move over to Ryobi's popular 18 volt platform and get that three year warranty with the support of your local Home Depot. And if you're thinking about a 12 volt platform, that brushless power core 12 drill that we mentioned earlier from Skill, that's another great option. Next up, we've got Black & Decker for the third time. This is their 20 volt max. It's the LD120VA kit. It's a kit that comes with a 1.5 amp hour battery, a charger, the drill, of course, and then you can see this has a really nice uh, 30 piece bit set that goes along with it. And, and we mentioned earlier that we were gonna see the older version, the LDX120, this is it. It's been around for, uh, I think about a decade now from the last time I checked. It's a good drill. It's gonna get a lot of your DIY projects done around your house. It's just not the most modern. And, and if we take a look here at the picture, uh, notice that the handle's not quite as uh, well-developed as the newer version. There's not as much over mold, so it's not quite as comfortable, even though it still does a good job. Now this one tops out at 750 RPM on that uh, on the performance side. And you can see normal price on this drill is $59.99. Amazon's got it for well under $50 at the time that we're shooting this. So without going over to the newer model, if you wanna take a look at something different, if you wanna go up and budget a little bit, you could move over to Craftsman. And Craftsman is a step up in, in the tier from Black & Decker. So if you don't know, Black & Decker Craftsman and DeWalt are all part of the same company, Stanley Black & Decker. It's publicly traded on, on the stock market. You can go check them out for yourself. So this is actually a step up in tier. You're going from the DIY to kind of the prosumer level. And it does come with a step up in price as well. That's $79. But this is a two-speed drill that's going to give you 350 RPM on the low end. It's going to give you 1500 RPM on the high side. Uh, 280 unit watts out, so actually just a little bit less power than that DeWalt drill that we were looking at earlier. And it's going to include a charger and a 1.3 amp hour battery to go with it. So it's a step up in performance. It's also a step up in price, but it's going to give you a, a wider range of projects that you can be able to handle with it. Black & Decker's LD120 is an older model, but it still can do a good job for you on those DIY projects. You might want to take a look at going with the newer LDX120 from Black & Decker, or you can take a look at those options we already mentioned from Ryobi, Skill, and Heart to get some upgrades. One other way you might want to go if you're thinking about moving up is to go ahead and jump into that Craftsman platform. Coming in at number six, we've got this eight volt drill from a company called Deco, and it's a 3 8 inch drill, and it comes with a two amp hour battery, a charger, it's got a torpedo level with it, along with a 41 piece bit set. So really nice kind of set to get you started. Uh, but one thing I want to point out, Deco is not a brand that we've used any of their products from, so we can't speak to the quality. And we do know that there are a couple of things here that we're a little concerned about anyway. And so when you're reading through some of the marketing materials, you, you scroll down 
and you very helpfully find this notice. This is not a professional or heavy duty drill. It works great for small projects. We'd agree with that. Uh, that's a good notice, uh, but you do see up here a little higher. It's, it's lightweight and powerful. That, that's not so true. Lightweight, yeah, we'll buy that all day long. It's a really nice compact drill. That eight volt battery is gonna be lighter than even a 12 volt battery, but powerful? No, it is not a powerful drill. So don't think you're gonna take a one inch spade bit and start drilling holes through wood with it. Now, instead, just looking at what this tool is and what it's designed to do, you may be more interested in a cordless screwdriver rather than a drill. And this one's actually not out yet at the time that we're filming. It's coming out in the middle of September. This is the Twist 2.0. It's a rechargeable four volt screwdriver from Skill. It's got several cool things going on with it. So first of all, uh, you can see it's very, very slim and it is designed for one thing and that's driving screws. So you're gonna small screws that you might be using around your house on different projects, you can do that. Several cool things on here, and we've got a full review on this that you can check out on our website. But up here, uh, the head pivots so that you can work into awkward uh, spaces easier. And this button right here, you just push that down and then pivot to either the other two angles up to 45 degrees that you want to go with. You can kind of see it right in here, but uh, this little skill logo is actually spinning inside. It's kind of fun to watch. And the battery on this one is built into the tool and it uses a USB-C plug that comes with it. And the price on this one is $29.99. That's going to be the regular price. And Skill actually runs some pretty solid deals throughout the course of the year. So we wouldn't be surprised to see this drop even further on some promotions. And again, just flipping back over here to Deco, their price right now is $29.99 as well. So it really is, are you wanting a lightweight drill or are you really looking for something that you want to drive screws with? We think Skill offers a really viable alternative here. Deco Speed makes it a faster option than cordless screwdrivers in the same price range. And understanding that we can't speak for its quality or longevity, it might be a good kitchen drawer drill for that reason. However, we suggest that you go ahead and move up to a quality 12 volt drill to get the performance you want if you've got DIY projects on your hands, or go ahead and grab a cordless screwdriver if driving screws is your main draw. All right, last but not least, we've got a brand called Comoware, and it's a 20 volt cordless drill that they have. This has a 1.5 amp hour battery and charger with it, and it has a very familiar looking bit set that comes along with it, similar to what we saw from Avid. Uh, I think the uh, the bit set itself may be identical. We definitely have that flex shaft in there, some drill bits and driver bits. Anyway, it's a nice little kit to get you started, 34 pieces in there. Now this one is a two speed drill. It tops out at 350 RPM on the low gear and 1300 RPM on the high side. And then it also has 266 inch pounds of torque to go along with it. Regular price $49.99. Right now on Amazon, it's on sale for $39.99. And uh, there's a 15% coupon on there making that price even a little more attractive. But there was one thing that we noticed. So take a look right here, okay? This is a $50 drill kit normally. And they're saying that it's waterproof and drop proof. We're a little skeptical that a $50 drill kit is actually waterproof and drop proof, particularly when they don't give us an IP rating or a drop test rating. So we don't really know what they mean by that, but we wouldn't use any of our drills underwater or even really trust them after they've been underwater. So it's kind of a quirky little claim there. So take it with a grain of salt for what you will. Other than that, it's got a really nice feature set. It looks like a lot of the DIY drills that we would normally recommend as far as features and shape goes. Comfortable looking drill and all that. So maybe, but if you want an alternative, we're actually gonna flip back over to Black & Decker again. And this is their Reviva. It's a 12 volt max. It's a 3 8 inch drill. And you can see it's got a little bit different shape than what we've seen before, but functionally it's gonna work the same as the others that we've, we've seen. Now, price on this is normally $49.99. You can see Lowe's has it on sale right now for $10 off, so $39.99, making that a little bit more attractive. Now, as far as the torque goes, it's in a similar range. It has 230 inch pounds of torque. This is a single speed drill with 550 RPM. So you don't get the same speed range that we saw with the Comoware drill. One other thing that makes this drill really kind of interesting, especially in today's day and age, is that Black & Decker uses recycled materials in its production. I'm gonna highlight this for you right here, make sure you can see it. And uh, in this particular model, you can see that it uses the equivalent weight of eight of those 16.9 plastic bottles that we normally drink water out of. So 
As far as that goes, kind of getting into, can we use recycled materials to create power tools? Does it affect the tool plastic and all that? We haven't seen anybody else do that yet. So really kind of compelling selling point to go with Black & Decker here. Similar price point, especially with the sale going on. So we think this is another viable alternative and we have a lot more confidence in Black & Decker's build than we do in these brands that we've never tested before or tried. Understanding that we can't vouch for ComaWare's quality, its performance, design, and features do make it an interesting option to have around the house. However, we have more confidence in Black & Decker's build, and the Revive is a better option because even though you lose some speed, the torque is in the same range, and you've got the use of recycled materials that went into the build, and that makes it a pretty compelling option. If you take a look at Amazon's top 100 list, Milwaukee, Ryobi, and Rigid are all over there. There's lots of options that you could buy. However, keep in mind that there are no authorized retailers of those brands anywhere on Amazon. We don't know where they're getting their tools from. We don't know if they're knockoffs. We have no idea what kind of quality you're getting. It's best to look at our deal pages and check out authorized dealers to pick up any of those brands. If you want more cordless drill action, we've got resources for you. So first of all, click right up here and check out our cordless drill head-to-head, -head, where we took 10 of the top cordless drill brands and tested them head-to-head. -head. Or if you want to read, Austin's going to put links down below for you where you can get to our best cordless drill recommendations for the year. And if lightweight's the way you want to go, we've got a feature specifically just for those. So what do you think? Did you want to buy those Amazon options or would you rather have some of the recommendations that we had instead? Let us know in the comments below and as always, thanks for watching.